Oh hey, it's Rob. And I'm out here with the trailer. Because I need to replace that fender. So it seems that someone who shall remain nameless managed to uh, walk this into a guard around some gas pumps and uh, drive into them. Taking it out pretty well. So I'm going to need to replace this. Well, step one is to make sure that you start on a cold and rainy day because that makes it all the better. Step two is to get the right tools. A T30 and an 11 millimeter socket. You can also use a 7 16th. Well, step three is just to remove them. And just like that, the fender is off. Next step is to go back inside and warm yourself up with some good warm food. This is some Thai coconut lime chicken. Next step is to order a replacement fender. Probably should have done that before you took the fender off. Uh, but once you get it, it looks like this. Now, one of the issues is the holes for the bolts do not come pre-drilled. So I'm going to want to drill these outer ones, and not the inner ones. The inner ones are just fine. The outer ones fit for the trailer that I've got. Uh, you want to check the trailer that you have because they may be different. These seem to be a universal fit for a lot of the caravan trailers. Uh, possibly some other ones. I don't really know. Uh, you can get these online. They're a few hundred dollars. Um, it's just a lot easier to do this than trying to repair the other one, even though I have all of the pieces. Because <clears throat> the person that did the uh, actual backing of the trailer was kind enough to collect all the pieces and put them in a cardboard box. I'm starting with a 13 64ths bit. It's one step below quarter inch. And it fits quite well. Uh, looking at this, I believe that these are made of polypropylene. I don't know if that's helpful to you at all. Uh, if you're into plastic welding, maybe you can do that kind of thing. Oh, let me get the other side too. <clears throat> now I'm going to start from the other side and go through with a quarter inch bit. <laughs> Tighten up your bits first. I like drilling into soft thermoplastics like polypropylene with a slow bit uh, because if you go really fast it can start to melt and then you end up with all sorts of problems. If you go slowly you can at least pull some, well, I don't want to call them chips, but they're, you know, they come out in long strips so you're not melting anything and the holes are much cleaner. Also I started with the 13 64th because that was the size of the internal hole. A uh, quarter inch bit wouldn't fit, so I had to drill all the way through. But the quarter inch is the correct size for these bolts. <clears throat> so the next step is to uh, realize that you made a mistake. And you uh, got the wrong side. The next step is to realize that all you have to do is turn it around and it's correct. You know, the difficult part of this is locating it in the right holes. Well, that's interesting. Well, isn't that special? It looks like they're not universal. Well, that's an interesting little conundrum, isn't it? Okay, a bit of a compromise. Uh, I used the two inner holes on this side, and then I had to drill new holes on this side because those inner holes also don't match. So uh, a little bit of custom drilling, but it fits, and it's on, and I'm going to install the bolts.
And there she is. Almost good as new. At some point I'll have to fill in those holes with some plastic welding stuff, but uh, that can wait for a day where it's not so rainy. All right, lessons learned. Number one, don't assume. It makes an ass out of Uma Thurman. And she holds a grudge and a sword. Uh, and we learned that Rob screws up. So, like, that's a new lesson. So I bought it as a caravan trailer part. Um, it came as a replacement part and looked exactly the same. I didn't measure it to find out that it was a slightly different size. So that's a surprise, but it's attached. It works. Uh, I'm not going to mess with it. I'll probably fill in the holes at some point, but uh, I'm not too worried about it because it's more functional than the, the previous one was. Um, but yeah, a little embarrassing, but okay. Uh, I guess that's it. I'll see you guys next week. All right, so... What? <coughs> what? I was just talking. I was talking to the camera. Do you want to talk to the camera? You want to talk to the camera? You want to talk to the camera? You just want to bark at me. <laughs> yes, I love you too. <clears throat> and she holds a grudge and a sword. <laughs> but I assumed they were the same. They weren't the same. But I was able to get it installed. It fits. It fits. <laughs> Very full of dog. Thank you, sissy. You're very healthy. You're very... She's not barking at anything. She's barking at me. You find somebody out there to play with? Hmm?